Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Welcome, everyone, to Jesus Christ. Turn that baby off. This, oh no. I'm gonna try. I'm fucking blind right now, dude. Guys, guys, this is a fun, a fun episode gimmick. This is the Brad is a blind episode, where Brad does an episode where he's fully blind, fully blind with some alien glasses on. Mm -hmm. And okay, you know when you do that, you gotta get some calm, relaxing music in there. That's right. Pretty good. A uh, hit. Um, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Second Hand TV. My name is Brad. I'm going to be your guide on this episode through episode two of the new Disney Plus limited show series. Yeah. Uh oh, someone's coming in with a verse. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> oh, I thought that was the lead into a verse. There was someone falling. Oh. Why? It's a great question. Why was anyone falling? Falling in love to this song. Really? Oh, well, you're going to make this little song a little horny. That's, the club and the get done. that's right. I lay a river body. And you still using that boring reusable underwear that you're only supposed to put your bodies. Guys, um, welcome, welcome. Uh, I'm done with this bit. This is impossible. <laughs> this is so impossible. To try to navigate any kind of clips. God, I'm an old ass person. Um. Uh huh. So I'm Brad. You know me. You know me. Yep. I'm I'm one of the guys. I'm the guy with a yellow microphone now, and in our little picture, I got an orange microphone. And, mm -hmm. you know, what do you got to say about that, huh? Mm hmm Magic. That's the magic of editing, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. CGI mic. Mm-hmm. First ever. CGI mic is my favorite VTuber. By the way, um, yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, guys, guys, <laughs> who can introduce your damn selves? Now, huh? what are you waiting for? You waiting for a, a song to play out, huh? Mm -hmm. Uh, hey, Levi here. You just got the second hand. Just got yeah. coconut mold. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Oh. Um. Hey, um, it's uh, I'm also here. It's me, Keenan. Welcome back. All right, your turn. See y'all. Who's Do your turn? blind bit? Huh? Mm -hmm. Do your blind bit, Keenan. Oh, my blind bit. Mm -hmm. Oh, um. Oh. Act like you are, um, you are walking, you're a blind man, and you have, um, let's see, what what's a good bit for a blind like person walking. to do? <laughs> a blind person is, wa you're a blind person trying to find the entrance to a uh -huh. nice little toilet. toilet. Trying like to find that. the toilet. And you're trying to turn around to sit on it, but you can't find it. 
All right, I'm and you have to just right. you just guess you just yeah. guess where it is and plop right, down with so full force. My chair's the toilet. All right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm watching. Yeah, I'm just put it like right here. But you're blind. Remember yeah. you're blind. Yeah. Remember you're blind. All right. So. so I'm just gonna okay. Drop trowel. Trial. He's he's moving his hands around trying to find it. Drop trowel. Moving, moving his hands around everywhere. <laughs> Surprisingly, not dropping trowel. <laughs> going going head first head into the first. toilet and <laughs> oh my god he he fucking broke it <laughs> he had <laughs> he he's head butted so the... used to being bullied <laughs> oh no he's so used to swirlies so used to swirlies that he he head butted it so hard that it shattered <laughs> <laughs> and that was badass Thank and that's you. what I call badass hell yeah Hell yeah, brother. Oh, not the hoedown music. Uh Uh-oh. Why do you do this? I was just looking for a badass track. Well, this is the hoedown music. You're right. (laughs) You did this on purpose. No, I didn't. I did not do it on purpose. Your voice is different now. It just happens. This is, this is just what happens, unfortunately. <laughs> I can't find a good wiki for this. Um, Damn it. It, I found a, vor- a Vulture article that is multiple pages long. About Loki? About Loki episode 2. Well, yeah, because they have to talk about every single timeline. True. True. There's so many. Very true. Um, and guys, this week we're talking about episode two. And I'm for real when I say it's episode two this week. Mm-hmm. Seriously. Mm-hmm. Seriously. And guys, you guys are not going to want to miss this episode where we talk about episode two of Loki, Ooh. guys. We're not late. Keenan, wait, that's what, okay, Keenan, it sounded like you were going to say another variant of you're not going to want to miss this, and then you yeah. just said, we're not late. <laughs> well, we're not. That's all I got out of that. So, yeah, episode two, guys, and you, you're going to hear it right after this break. Hey, what's up? We're back again, guys. Um, here to talk about episode two of Loki. That's right. You're not gonna want to miss this one. I, you, I, you're this not, one we're talking about episode two of Loki, and that's for real. That's right. Right after this. Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, we're we'll back. back. Welcome back. To another What's episode up? of Second Hand TV. What's what episode is on the menu today, Brad? Today we are looking at What's the chef serving up today? Uh, wait um Uh is it episode three? Oh shoot, oh, that's man. right. It's episode two. And wow. we're gonna get into it right after this. Hey everybody! What's up, guys? <laughs> um, We're back. Sorry for those interruptions. We're talking about us, episode two of Loki. Right after this. Right after this. Hey, what's up? Hey, Did you miss us? You better. Like I said, don't go nowhere. I know you're all still here. We know you're in episode two of Loki. Well, you better be. Well, do I have a surprise in for you? Right after after this. this. Hey, hey, 
guys have, <laughs> guys ever noticed this? What's oh, the, yeah. What's the... Oh, my clones are here on stage with me. Oh, hey, hey, Larry. Hey, what's the deal with episode two of Loki? Episode two of Loki? Oh, oh, the director saying not to talk about that until after this short break. Really? Yep. All right, right after this. And ladies and gentlemen, we are here today. Live. For, live from the set. That's right. Of Loki episode two. Guys, what do you think is going to happen today? What kind of fun do you think we're going to have in this episode? Um, well, Jack, I think there's going to be a big touchdown in this episode. Yeah, Zach? Touchdown that... kind, of kind of fun. Yeah, touchdown kind of fun? That is a good guess, Mac. Thank you, thank you. Uh, what was your name again? My name is Jack. Jack, Mac. Right. And don't forget our other colleague, Zach, here. Black. Zach Black. Zach Black. Black. Right. And, guys, you might it's... Know me from my Yes. What what kind of movies have you been in again? Uh, Kung Fu Trash Panda, where I play a raccoon. Oh, oh wow. okay. Kung Fu, pretty cool. Yeah. And then, and what was it like to work on that set? Mm -hmm. I... it, was, it was real great. Um, I did all my stunts. Oh, you did really? all your own stunts, like I Jackie Chan. A, yeah, I put on a raccoon costume. And like a convention full of people. And we just like okay. Movie. So it wasn't a show. <laughs> this sounds like a convention, Zach. What? No. There's Zach. Cameras. There's can. Well, you got us there. Cameras is a show. You got us there. <laughs> Was this part of Cameras the show? Two. I fought a possum. You fought oh. a possum. Was this a? I remember this. This was, yes, this was covered ostensibly on the news. Man murders possum in broad daylight. Mm -hmm. You did that out in the middle of the street. Mm -hmm. With a hockey puck. Yeah. <laughs> well, I do love hockey. You're All right, and that I, hockey I is to brought say, to us by um, to Loki. Isn't oh, that right. That is right. Loki is brought to. Hockey is brought to us by Loki. Loki. Loki Martin. That's right. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to throw it over to the Loki experts to talk about episode two. Mm -hmm. Guys, the time has finally come. I can't I can't think of of any other way to say it. I think we've but got here comes our commercial break. Are you tired of having a lame baby? Is your neighbor's baby Chad Alpha as fuck and getting all the attention? Buttholes, you know what I'm saying? Are you tired of your baby being addicted to breast milk and wish it was addicted to something way cooler? <laughs> well, introducing Jewel. That's right, J -j -j Jewel pacifiers. The coolest, reddest, e sick pacifier for your baby. Watch as one hit from the Jewel pacifier turns your baby from a lame as fuck nerd baby to the coolest jock baby on the street. Yeah. These come in all kinds of sick, nasty flavors for your baby. Hit vape flavors include mushy carrots, apple spinach, can't handle the truth, and b -b -b breast milk. Using special Super Bowl the promo code concussion for 420% off your order. Yeah, the salami. 420%. So get your baby a jewel pacifier online. 
or at any major store outlet today. Oh, guys, we are back from that commercial break. Thank you for yes. sticking it in. Thanks for being so patient with us. And guys, I think it is finally time. Yep. You promise? Let's throw it to the audience. Audience, what do you think? Woo! Yeah, baby! That's what I've been waiting for. That's what it's all about. Audiences, audiences, excited. Yes, they're excited. <laughs> Why did we randomly mic one guy in the audience? <laughs> <laughs> he won. He's he won the com- only audience member. Yes, he won the competition to be the only audience member. <laughs> mm-hmm. We the, uh, the applause we got. That was the soundtrack. Yes, that was all fake. That was all fake. Yeah, we're all about transparency here. Mm-hmm. We're all about transparency, so if you want to be part of the live studio audience, you have to win a lottery system, mm-hmm. and then you will be the only audience member. It's a very intimate show, and we make eye contact with you the whole time. That's right. It's very nerve-wracking. For us. <laughs> I'm terrified of eye contact. Yep. I mean, you remember... You remember the last time that I I went on a date? Mm-hmm. You guys were all yeah. there. You guys were all... Yeah, you were almost all... killed that girl. I almost killed her. That's right. Why? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know. What? <laughs> well, you said you would drive her home, and you took her somewhere else? I... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's because she insisted on um, I wouldn't look at her the whole time. Um, so she said, "Yeah, drive me home to this cave that I live in with all my sisters," and I thought that's weird. Um, yeah. But then she she insisted on riding home on the hood of my car, and so. You know, yeah. I refused. I refused to look at her. Um, yeah. And since she was on the hood of your car and you couldn't look at her, you had to drive with a blindfold on and nearly killed her. Yeah, yeah. But I well, found out she later. Was, she was shouting you directions the whole time. Yes, exactly. Yeah, Almost yeah. Gone. And she had like a lot of. She had a lot of like snakes that gave her directions too. Hmm. Um, I don't know. That Tied was her, huh? Like in her hair, or yeah, yeah. I found out later her name was Medusa. Um, Medusa Oblongata, but is her last name? Yeah, mm-hmm. that's that is correct. <laughs> Medusa Oblongata. <laughs> um. So yeah, I think it's a good thing that I didn't look at her the whole time. Did she talk about Loki at all? I think she did. And you want to know what she said? Yeah. Well, you're in luck cuz we're going to get to it right after this. <laughs> okay. Man. Uh, you said thanks, but that's a pretty scary date dude oh yeah it was terrifying like now looking back on it looking back on it it was absolutely stupid of me but yeah. you know that's just what happens sometimes mm-hmm. um all right it's 20 minutes we can start now oh okay okay yes good, we good, hit good. the marker yes we are contractually we obligated we are not allowed to start talking about the episode until 20 minutes in, as That's says right. our contract. Mm-hmm. Um, but let's talk about it, guys. Um, our contract? That's right. Our contract <laughs> is Amazon.com. <laughs> we have a contract with Amazon.com to not mm-hmm. talk about... Or Disney movies and TV That's shows. right. That's right. <laughs> 
Yeah. Yeah. So anytime we're doing a Disney movie, we had to wait 20 minutes to weed out all those pesky listeners who, who don't care, you know? Yeah. Um, and now that it has been 20 minutes, we are allowed to start talking about the episode. Um, but not obligated. Exactly. We can continue to not talk about it if we want. Um, hey, when, when they told us to sign that contract, I put Donald Duck. Oh, really? So I can do whatever I want. That's that's a good one. You signed your name as Donald Duck? Mm-hmm. Or you drew Donald Duck? Mm-hmm. Well, that was a weird phase in your life where you did think you were Donald Duck. <laughs> it comes and goes. Uh, mm-hmm. You have very specific schizophrenia. Yeah. Yes, multiple personality disorder. But it's really two multiple personality disorder. Mm-hmm. And one is that. Donald Duck. <laughs> so you go around wearing a tight red polo shirt and okay. no no pants whatsoever. Mm-hmm. A hat. You do have a hat. Sometimes. I will give you credit for that. That one's pretty good. Uh huh. That's the only way. (laughs) Yeah, yeah. (laughs) And I don't know if people know this. Um, do do people know about your cameo in The Mandalorian? No, they don't. Yeah. So, so there was a little a little like camera pan over to Keenan as Donald Duck with the Pringles in his mouth whenever they said this is the only way. And a lot of people, they omit only from the quote, too. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, that all, that all happened. Um, Disney was pissed. Were they? Oh, wait. Amazon was pissed. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Amazon was pissed. Um, for obvious reasons, we all know. Right. Instead of uh, me saying this is the only way, I was trying to get the script changed to this is my only fans, and it would be me promoting my Donald Duck only fans. That is. That Why does is, it seem I, like you just made that up? Well, I was going to say that that's hot. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> That is obviously so hot. Um, hey, make make it a follower goal. You know? Yeah. Now it, now it seems even more like you just made it up. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Keenan's. It's Keenan's Donald Duck only fans, and Keenan. I mean, why don't you tell us a little bit of the details of that? Like feathers, mm-hmm. or lack thereof. Feathers oh. or lack thereof. <laughs> that is both ends of the spectrum. You can you literally like not go wrong. <laughs> Which do you appeal, prefer? To appeal to everyone, okay? <laughs> how do you like how do you do that? Or not? Is is do you? <laughs> Do you put feathers on one side of your body and that's it? And if so, what half do you put the feathers on? He takes he takes one picture from one angle that's naked and one picture from the other angle, angle that's covered in feathers. Puts them both on the only fan. Let's say I have a, a peach that's smooth and feathery. A peach? Is that something that all ducks have? Uh, yeah. Hmm. How much is this gonna cost them? Yeah, that's the real kicker. What do you mean? Kicker. Well, if we reach our... If we reach the goal, then they won't have to pay for it. Oh, wow. It's like a Oh, okay. So right now, it is priceless. 
and if we reach, what do you want to say, 30 followers? Mm hmm. 30 followers. It is worthless. Exactly. If we hit 30, it becomes worthless, and we will make it free. That's right. Um, yeah, okay. I'm adding it right now. Um, let's see. <laughs> okay, I'm reading some of our other follower goals. Because we're at 24 right now. Um, 24 just says, Levi dances like a monkey. I don't remember what that is in reference to. Um, 23 followers was OK Boomer Girl comes on the podcast. And, and comes was C-U-M-S. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, that's gotta happen soon. Yeah, we're working on that. 22 was the Shy Boys band debut with the hit Girl from Ipanema. I think we did that. Uh, we totally did that. And 21 was uh, Free Day. It's sweet for us. Um, okay, 30. Donald Duck. Only fans. Only fans. That's sick. There we go, that's in there. Alright. Well, guys, what do you think we... What do you think about talking about episode? <laughs> of Loki. <laughs> that's a little, that's a touchy subject. You're right. You're At right. At this point. <laughs> it is a little bit touchy. <laughs> uh, we... we can dip our fingers in the Loki water. I don't know, you want to end the episode? It was, it was pretty touchy. <laughs> end the episode. <laughs> Let's cut I it. Guess especially towards the end. We're just touching everyone. Uh -huh. Yeah, cut it here. Yeah, let, yeah we'll, let's cut it. We'll see you guys later. Bye. I can't find them. I can't. <laughs> I don't want to say that. I don't want people to leave. <laughs> but I. I <laughs> uh, or do I? No, let's. <laughs> guys, let's talk about this dang episode. All right, Start it, guys. Guys. Episode 2, <laughs> the variant. Oh my god. Episode 2. We have to talk about it. Two, the, the variant strikes back. Mm -hmm. Is it? Yes. And that's because Star Wars? Yeah, yeah. Return of the Variant is uh, the first one was called that. Return of the Variant was the first one. Mm -hmm. That's a weird name for the first of anything. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. very weird. That that doesn't. It, that's not how it's, titles work. It's part of the hook. Mm -hmm. It's they like wanted you to be confused because exactly of all of the like time stuff going on. That it could actually make sense. Yeah, it's possible that you could have just forgotten that the variant ever left. You know? The variant was inside you. Uh huh. He was gone, but he returned. Mm -hmm. and yeah. You forgot about it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Until the first episode where yeah. you read that title, and then you were like, oh, oh he's I... back. Hey, I lost the game, and then your friend hits you or something. Yeah, yeah. So episode two, right? How does this? How does this shit start? I feel like part uh, of the reason why talking about the episodes is so hard is because I watched the life is fuck o mode for me, so I watch them. Mm -hmm. late when I'm very tired and I feel like I enjoy it and then all the fine details just like go right out and you I remember maybe, maybe we played clips then 
Start the episode off with clips? Yeah. Fuck Get it, why not, you. dude? I mean, I, I remember how it starts. Oh boy, looks like we got ourselves a good old truth exchange. So go for it, Keenan. All right, well, I think it starts with Loki talking to Miss Minutes, the little hologram thing. That's, That's right. That's right. So they have a little exchange. He tries to kill her because she's like sort of alive or sentient. Oh, yeah, that's annoying. He tries to swat at her with a jet yeah. ski magazine. But that... he, she's too far ahead of him. Oh, yeah, she Ooh. knows the whole, she knows everything that'll ever happen. She's yeah. a hologram. What? What is the jet ski thing? What's the big deal? This guy is obsessed with Dude, jet skis. So if you we have a jet ski. so if you have a jet ski and you slowly replace the parts over time, but you take right. the old parts and put them exactly together until you have a whole new jet ski, it, which is the real jet ski, right? Yeah. Um. Which is not an, a question that they posed in this uh, episode was, at all. If you actually pause it, it's, it's what's written in the Jet Ski magazine. Oh, I <laughs> see. And who's writing on it? Wayne Gretzky. With WandaVision. Wayne Gretzky on a jet ski. That's e right. Oh, Eating a pretzel. understand that. Eating a pretzel. And what is a pretzel? It's a pretzel. It's a, it's a, yeah, it's a pretzel. Oh. In the shape of a Y. <laughs> why? In the, a pretzel in the shape of a Y. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'd ask... I don't know. Very I did. feel like that is harder to... That is harder to shape dough into than just a normal pretzel. Just I will pretzel. say. Yeah, to shape it in. The joint? The joint <laughs> is going to be weird. <laughs> you have to split it apart and stitch it back together. Because there's no way you get a Y. I think, I think you're right. <laughs> That's impossible. It's a, a, a prezi is impossible. <laughs> Case you know closed. I think Myth you busted. might be able to do it. <laughs> okay. There's a way you could do it. Okay. Is this going to have to be another follower goal? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to add it. Shy Boys try to make... explains how to make a pretzel. Just explains it? I thought we were going to we were gonna see if it could be done. Oh, no, I can explain it. I'm a I theoretical I well, uh, I pretz petition. Why would we... I, I mean, if we want to be boring, I guess... <laughs> I guess we can just put a follower goal... Yeah, we'll explain something. <laughs> yeah, no, it could be that we'd make it. I think that comes before the OnlyFans. Yeah. So It'll I'm gonna be say theoretical until we make it. So twenty seven um Mythbusters can't is is it possible to make a Prezi? Prezi, yeah. All right, y'all really just let the let the air there sit, huh? Yep, we love it. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, how do we talk about Loki? Guys, how do we talk about how do we talk about a TV show? Um, Hello. Guys, we really we really gotta fucking talk about this TV show. It is nine forty eight. And we have oh, talked about it. Know. We've talked about a jet ski. <laughs> it's a great show. It's really a great oh. show, guys. Um, so, 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 what's up with Loki just being like, eh, "I'll work for them, whatever." Um, let's see. So, his ulterior motives. You think? Well, I think well he says towards the end that he wants to take the TVA over. But does he actually want to or was he just trying to trick the right. variant? You never know with this guy. Yeah. That's the thing. Yeah, I could see like in the end that 
it's like the show's about Loki, so maybe in the end he's gonna like have the upper hand on everyone because he's still Loki. Yeah. But the show really makes him seem like a dumbass. What do you mean? He solved the whole apocalypse thing. Dude, but like it made it seem like it was just like happenstance. And it made it like a very small deal about it. I thought it was a big deal. You think so? Yeah, Mobius was like so happy that he figured that out. Hmm. Mobius is a pretty cool name. I'll say it. I'll be brave. Um, wow. <laughs> it is. It is very but brave. I don't know. I don't. I don't Love think. <laughs> thanks. I don't think Loki uh, comes across as as a dumbass. Mm-hmm. I think he's just like. I don't know. He's just not good at fighting. But maybe I'm just not like looking at this critically. You know. I just think they all like treat Loki like he's a dumbass. Like literally every character is like this guy does not know what he's talking. Well, yeah, because it's like he's a variant. They just hate variants right off the bat. So yeah, yeah they'll like so... belittle him or just make fun of him. Wow, so prejudiced. Mm. <laughs> oh shit! What's up? Okay, Keenan Crap. This is why Keenan let let the air be silent. But Keenan solved the Prezi. Did he? Potentially. Oh. What? Potentially, but you know. Wait, how do you know? We're gonna. In, it's in the Discord, but we can't. We can't disparage those secrets. Mm-hmm. If you want, oh, if you no. want the secret revealed. Then get three more people to follow our dang Twitch channel, okay? So and fucking to... how? And how about you get in here and watch the dang live stream, huh? Every Tuesday night. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Every day before the new episode comes out. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good so... refresher, guys. <laughs> I'll say it. Hmm. You can't make a pretzel without cutting it. That Dude, is that is true. <laughs> That's the conjecture. That's Levi's conjecture. Too much on pretzies. Hmm. Well, I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to Anyways, wait. We'll have to wait we'll and have to see. Find out. Um. Maybe Keenan has a point. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Look, if you couldn't, guys, guys, if you couldn't tell, I am, I am incredibly scatterbrained today because Same. work has just taken everything from me. Work is like Thanos coming to my planet and destroying half of it. Just snapping away half of your brain synapses. Yeah, but I feel like he used to. Before he snapped, he went. He just went to planets and destroyed them, right? You think he just was like? I don't know. Isn't that what he did? I'm gonna get a quarter of these planets here and just kill them. I thought he went to that one planet where he met like his daughter and he like killed everyone. Oh, maybe. Isn't that what happened? Work well, has been work has been like Omni Man, like punching my face, and mm-hmm. I am invincible. And then like, I'm getting I'm getting my ass fucking caved in. Yeah. And then. But you're still alive. But I'm still alive. Slightly. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And like, I'm trying to get persuaded. Because they're like, look at what they need to, for, fuck, dude, to I don't mimic even, our power. A half of our power or something like yeah. that. Yeah. You know. Keenan, you all right there, bud? I'm just reading a recap. <laughs> yeah. What if we, y'all, what y'all if we, uh, what if we talk, talk about our clips? Look, okay, let's. There's no way we get distracted on look, clips. Here's, 
Levi, here's what I'll say. We got to go, we got to get like a a couple's, um, the psychiatrist's uh, visit. Okay. So we can get some fucking help. Um, <laughs> somebody need somebody needs to help us. Yeah. Um, no. Okay. But this, this episode, right? So mm-hmm. we get in the beginning, Loki is fucking talking to clock girl. Then there's a bunch of shit that happens and Mobius is like, I need your fucking help, dude, to figure out where this variant is hiding. And then he helps him out and he's like, dude, any any disaster, any doomsday, he's hiding in there. And then Well, because like because like there's you know, those people are all gonna die in doomsday shit. So it would because no the salad's to gonna the be timeline. the salad's gonna be ruined anyways. Yeah, you already put mustard mm-hmm. in the salad. Yeah, so you know. Sorry, fuck. Yeah, if the mustard's going in the salad regardless, then you can take a shit in the salad before, and no one will care. Mm-hmm. Um, what if you just clean the salad after? Yeah, but the salad is people dying, so you had to bring them back to life. The infinity stones can do that. <laughs> yeah, but they don't work. Oh, at not, the TVA. not at the TVA. Yeah. At the TV Association. Mm-hmm. I the salad metaphor kind of breaks down when you think too hard about it. No, it doesn't. Mm. I don't think so. He's just showing the actions of the salt and the pepper getting washed away by the apocalypse. Yeah. Saying it doesn't matter. None of that shit's going to matter anyways, because then your salad's going to get milk in it. I don't think that was milk. What do you think it was? Cum. Oh, cum. Yeah. Pizza. Cum. I think it was Um, ranch dressing. The apocalypse made the salad better. (laughs) It was ranch... It was ranch in a little milk carton. Mm-hmm. Hey, TVA is different. And that is what you can get next time you come down. 99 cents. 99 cents. You know where. And we call it Juicy Ranch. 100% milk and ranch. Gummies. And gummies. It, okay. What, are, what? Hold on. I don't even know what this product is anymore. I don't know what it is. I'll tell you where you can get it. The Nasty Olive Garden. Right. Go down to the nasty. It's called a ranch flavored milk and cummies. Ranch flavored. Okay. But what? It's a confusing name because it's actually ranch. It's actually okay. So is can somebody answer this burning question I I have? This is this needs to go on our interview question list. Uh, do you have to say when? Is that it? Wait, what? Yes, you do have to say when. My my question, my big question that I've had rattling around in my brain for years uh-huh. is, what the fuck is ranch dressing? What's the sh- what's it made out of? It could be. Look, it could be. It could be milk and cummies, for all I know. <laughs> and I could be dipping my dang tendies in there and eating it up like a, a, it's a goddamn smoke show, having been none the wiser to what I'm actually eating. Wow. So come down to Nasty Olive Garden and get our garbage salad smothered. In ranch. We don't know what it is. Maybe you could figure it out. Um, right. and so, look, that happens, and, uh... They go to Pompeii to prove it. That's right. They go to Pompeii, and Loki starts speaking 
in uh, Levi's Big favorite block. language. Italian, that's right. Mamma oh. mia. He goes up he there. Says. Do you remember what exactly he says up there, Levi? I mean, you've got to remember. You remember yeah, everything said, Italian, right? He said, And I'll pretend like I'm the volcano in the background. Right, right. I'm <laughs> from the future. <laughs> but in, that vol- in Italian. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> uh, you forgot the hand. You forgot the hand. <laughs> Pizza for- time. Uh. Time for the pizza to explode on the mountain, yeah. The mountain going to be like your favorite pizza. Just so much marinara coming out. Explode like your pizza that you have. A marinara. The marinara is going to explode just like a pizza oven does. (laughs) Whenever you make it too hot. (laughs) Oh no! I remember when that happened to me. That's Shut right, up, Luigi. Luigi. <laughs> you killed my wife. That's right. It's going to happen to you now, Luigi. <laughs> oh, no. It's okay. We're sorry about Daisy. It's okay. There's nothing you can do. Just put some mustard on it. Oh, no. Oh, Somebody... you got some ranch. Oh, what's that stuff made out of? No. Oh. And that's how it was at Pompeii. <laughs> In 79 AD. Exactly how it happened. Is that when it happened? Mm-hmm. You are an Italian... Fiend. Fiend. Yep. That's right. Um. So, they do that, and then they're like, he's in Alabama. Um, because of gum? Yeah, like something candy. Like that? Special candy. That was produced for like five years. Oh, wow. that's right. That's how they narrowed it down. Um, good old product placement. <laughs> um, but he he had a the little girl had a kablooey, and they said, "Uh oh, this candy was only made in this time," and so they like. I did like how when they were going through all that stuff, um, all those disasters that they were talking about, and it was very much stuff that I'm like, oh yeah, that stuff is gonna happen, huh? Dude, we are gonna have giant depressed me. We are gonna have giant climate disasters in a fucking tsunami, and it's just gonna kill thousands Everyone. upon thousands yeah. of people that's pretty that's pretty cool disney uh, one of the other ones was like a species of bird dying and ruining the ecosystem oh Dude, yeah why we have to move oh yeah that was very cool of disney in there like oh yeah if we put this shit in our show people will think that we're like doing shit and not <laughs> fucking not a giant corporation that's causing so much of this destruction that we're talking about. And it's actually kind of funny. It's pretty cool. You... you know, BP actually pitched them the whole the whole spiel. Oh, really? Yeah. And we love BP so much. Yeah. BP, we love them. Um, burger. What's Party. I... <laughs> Oh. Party. I thought I thought it was Bachter Pepper. Um <laughs> but I guess I'm wrong. I thought it was I thought it was Bountain Pew. Then why did you say burger party? <laughs> <laughs> well that's what I wanted that's for my birthday. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well why didn't you just say so? <laughs> why did... Yeah, why you went to, to be so cryptic You went to dang about Sesame it. Street for your birthday. You, oh, yeah. you said you wanted it. Come on. Well, just, just, slide. just speak what you want. Come I'm sorry. on. I'm sorry. Next year. Okay. This year, burger party for sure. We'll mm-hmm. all remember this. Next year, Dr. King Pepper. Wait, King? Dr. King, Dr. King Pepper? <laughs> I don't know why I said King. I don't know either. So they go to um, this Alabama place, 
Right. And then they're going through, and they, hey, gang, let's split up. That's never fucked anybody over. And one guy's mm-hmm. like, I just buying plants. No big deal. Just plants. Dude, that guy was. So that guy, yeah, that, that guy, guy was, was possessed, he was a right? Superhero, right? That guy was possessed by by Loki, right? Oh, that yeah. was Plant Man. Because then he touched the That's, police yeah. officer chick. Okay, because I saw it and I was like, I mean. Fuck, dude, that seems real enough to me. You know, 2050. We're having a natural disaster sale. Come get our shit for 50% off. And people are like, oh, fuck, dude. I mean, once in a lifetime. I gotta go buy plants. I mean, sometimes you just risk it, you know? Oh, sometimes you gotta risk public safety to get a good deal. Like, if you're on the road and the floodwaters are really high... You could probably make it. How are you going to look? How are you going to get oxygen without that plant? You need it. Mhm. And there's just so much water coming to like water it. Exactly. Exactly. Think about the future return on investment. You got so much water to feed that bad boy. Mhm. You uh, you're sitting on a a gold mine. So look. Um all that happens, and then Loki, female Loki. First of all, let's just talk about the reveal. Keenan was right. Bam, bam, bam. Keenan did it. Woohoo. <laughs> yeah, I told you guys after the podcast ended. So. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's right. Oh. Well, yeah, you ruined that for me. So thanks. I wasn't. It made me more excited. I'm just kidding. It didn't ruin anything. It made me more excited watching it because I was like, "Oh, is it gonna be girl Loki? Did is that true?" Um, yeah. Whereas if I wasn't watching it, I probably would have been like, "Oh, okay, it's a yeah. girl." Mm-hmm. Um, I didn't think she would be blonde though. Yeah. I thought she'd have black hair. Yeah. How many... How many, uh... How many Republicans do you think are triggered by this decision to, um, give the role to a woman? Because we Um, all... I don't know. I wouldn't say that this is that big a deal. Unless she Hmm. turns out to be, like, I don't know, bisexual or something. I am all like, well, Loki is like gender fluid, is what they had on his like little oh, report yeah. thing. Yeah, when they were first like turning him into the TVA, I oh. saw that. Yeah, I did see that as well. Let's so, see. Yeah, I'm gonna look up female <laughs> Loki controversy and see if anything comes up. Ah, wow. Nope. Nothing. Maybe I'm you know, nothing. I'm sort of wow. I'm kind Maybe of wondering just... if uh what? If like her if Thor like for her would be a girl. Oh, you get a whole girl girl dimension and here is where people get triggered. Ooh, um, that would be cool, dude. A whole and, girl dimension? Yeah. Whole girl Sign dimension. Me up. Oh, more and more. Oh, oh. I mean, shoot, cool. drop me off of that world. I mean, like, uh, I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't want to go there. I gotta get for a whole world, huh? Oh, I mean, like, I, <laughs> I mean, if you exist, I'll do I, it. I mean, <laughs> I mean, look, look. I mean, like, somebody's got to do it. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Anyways. So, <laughs> um, hey, just don't tell my wife. <laughs> tell my, hey, tell my wife I'm going to the, to the boy's house. 
<laughs> so um yeah we find out about that and uh let's see and then at the end um here's the exciting the most exciting part of the episode for me mm-hmm. was the ending so loki follows female loki through the time yeah, portal yeah dude hell yeah that's awesome yeah dude now I'm excited for things to start getting weirder. Yeah. Um, I thought I thought it could or it had already maxed out its weirdness, so I'm glad they got away from the TVA for now. Yeah. I mean, it's still going to be a thing. Like Mobius is going to be looking for him. Yeah, I agree. But at least now it's not another oh, TVA. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it's good to see a new perspective because, like, yeah. we're supposed to believe the TVA is like the good guys for this show, and now yeah. we get to see female Loki's perspective and why she's doing the things she's doing. Yeah, and if one Loki thinks that something's right, maybe all of the Lokis would think that something's right too, and maybe. Yeah, they. I mean, they. You would one. think they have similar mindsets or goals. Yeah. Or they can convince each other, but yeah, we'll we'll see. Yeah, right. I'm excited because we got the the female Loki went and did the bomb or whatever, and then set off all these branching timelines. Mm-hmm. And so I'm excited to see all of. I'm excited to see all the alternate timelines, dude. That's gonna be fucking yeah. dope. We're gonna get. Yeah into you know the fucking president loki shit that we've seen on the teasers um i'm excited to see what the fuck happens Um, have you guys seen any youtube video talking about all the like dates of all the branches of the timeline no i haven't wait wait what yeah there's a couple videos out there that talk about each date it splits Mm-hmm. And how it relates to the Marvel Universe. Really? So one would be really? like the fight in New York. And then another one would just be like, you know, Ragnarok or something. Yeah. So these are all new alternate timelines, which I don't know if they might address this series or later. Mm-hmm. But it's pretty cool. Damn, that is cool interesting um let's see let's see what i wrote down for notes if if anything another Um, thing is that the two or like the one cop loki captured seemed to like she looked like she was having like a breakdown or mental breakdown um but it, it seemed more like that her like previous memories came back to her like i don't think she was always at the tva and loki like broke the spell Hmm. in a sense so she realized where she was from and she got like mind controlled into working at the tva oh that'd be interesting the timekeepers are bad boys doing some some... yeah like how do they get their workforce you know that's like you can't like it just didn't appear out of nowhere do you either like brainwash variants into like working there or you just i don't know oh my god they're all variants maybe oh do you think see i think mobius's love of jet skis is from his past life like him growing up in the 90s or whatever that's got to be some about... type of Easter egg, right? Where he loves he loves jet skis in real life or something. I think the Easter egg is that he's going to have to sacrifice himself by like for a jet ski. No, like he, he oh. has to like hold a bunch of bombs, but he has to drive a jet ski at the bad guy <laughs> and like blow himself up <laughs> along with the bad guy. Oh wow! <clears throat> yeah, it's going to be real great. It sounds like it. <laughs> um, here's my That's only crazy. notes from the episode: is 
Wow, Wisconsin really was still like in medieval times in 1985. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Wisconsin. Um, yeah, it, I had two lines of notes as well. <clears throat> and then I wrote, "Who's your favorite Loki variant?" Because I feel like they were they were showing a few different like Loki variants, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I don't honestly. I don't remember who any of them were right now. There was like one that was green Hulk mode. Yeah, one of them looked like a a Hulk. Yeah. Hulk, okay, so there's Hulk mode, Loki. Um, I'm not going to be able to find it by skimming through. I think in the comic books they mentioned like a kid Loki. Mm, Okay. I think Uh, my... I think one of my favorites from the comics yeah um is uh let's see the the one that they did they did a like a crossover with um Nintendo oh, and they had really? like a yeah they had a Donkey Kong Loki um oh and he was pretty cool what was it called Doki Doki, yeah, Doki. Doki, Doki Kong. Uh huh. Doki Kong. Um, and he essentially he still did all of his tricks and whatnot, but mm-hmm. all the stuff that he did, rather than trying to do it for you know a tesseract, he was just trying to get bananas the whole time. Um, yeah, that's cool. Yeah, and you have know, you the, seen the one with the. Uh... Lokio and Princess Peach. Yeah, that was actually that was the same. Uh, it was the same universe. It was all. It oh. was all in the same universe, and everyone was actually played by Loki. Um. So, yeah, yeah, you remember that one, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, and Toad was Toki. Toki, um, you know, uh, Bowser. Bowser was broski. <laughs> real, real cool guy. <laughs> All right, Levi. Levi apparently does not want to contribute to this one. No, I came back. I ca- I was acting like I was asleep because because uh, my computer lagged out big time. Dude, oh, you got, okay. You got, you got Narco Pepsi. Yeah. Narco Pepsi coming back. Mm-hmm. Um. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's all right. We were just talking about the the Nintendo variants of Loki. Um, mm-hmm. I heard most of it. Yeah. Do you have a Do you have a favorite variant of Loki? Um the the one where he was just a uh, ranch dressing. That's that right. Cool. That's right. There was a whole arc in the comet, in the oh, yeah. in the comics. Ranch key. Ranch key. That's right. Yeah. Uh, um, he was real like a trickster, but then it was funny because no one knew what he was made out of. Yeah. And that was kind of the whole deal. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How does he do it? You know. Nobody knows. <laughs> um. What about Lokeister? Uh-huh. Lokeister, Lokeister yeah. Lokeister Lokeist- bunny. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> that one was pretty, pretty cool. Because he, uh-huh. he would hide all of the Easter eggs, but he would fill them with stuff that you wouldn't want. Like, so, like... Um, mm-hmm. Ranch. <laughs> ranch. He would <laughs> uh, fill some with, you know, um, with mortgage bills... Um, he would put, you know, he would put, like, mostly just bills. He was also really thick. He, he, had, he had a big butt. Yeah? When yeah. he was the... When he was the Lokeister bunny? bunny? Lo- Lokeister bunny, yeah. Uh-huh. Because his, his keister was so big? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that one was pretty good. Um, I think the last, I mean, you know, Porn Key. 
we can't forget about porn key. Um, right. and that one's self-explanatory. Oh. Uh-huh. I couldn't see that one. Oh, why not? It wasn't available in your country. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Feels bad. Feels bad, and that's why you gotta go ahead, and you gotta go and get Nord. Nort. Nort to BPN. That's N- right. Nort BPN. <laughs> um, what is BPN? Um, big. Virtual? No, okay. big. It's big. Oh. It's big penis energy. Big po- pussy noise. <laughs> What's all, it's one of the... <laughs> shit. <laughs> it's one of those. Um. Also, did you say energy? Yeah, and and <laughs> energy. <laughs> right. Um. So. Yeah. Before we get into clips, it, it, does anyone have anything else? Um. Uh, what do you think? I they think. Want? I think I don't know. I think female Loki is gonna show normal Loki that like. There's the sacred timeline power. is actually bad. It's and actually bullshit. Yeah, like something. There's a reason, like they want to keep it the way it is, mm-hmm. and it's to like benefit either the timekeepers or whoever's in charge. Mm-hmm. And like we haven't seen whoever's in charge, so we don't know if the timekeepers are actually at the TVA or not. There was something in this episode that like made me back on the side of like the timekeepers are real because i know that last week we brought up the possibility of them not being real but i'm back on i'm back on timekeepers are real side really team yeah that's me personally so what made you think that i don't remember (laughs) oh okay i don't remember Mobius talked about getting an interview with loki or not was an interview something like Setting up Loki with the timekeepers, but I don't think he had the power to do that. Mm. I don't know. I feel like I need to put a, you know, a disclaimer an hour and eight minutes into this episode that I I didn't dislike this episode. I I liked this episode. I'm just so, like, mentally spent. <laughs> and that is what's making... <laughs> this episode so so hard yeah so you know i don't want people to think that we didn't like this episode or i didn't yeah. like this episode i like this whole series really well really well really well really you, well you like yeah. it really well uh-huh. um and that's what you say whenever you go to a <laughs> steak house <laughs> <laughs> really well yep. sir how do you how do you want your uh pepsi <laughs> really well and they always ask you how you want your Pepsi. <laughs> and your salad. Mm-hmm. My salad. Mm-hmm. Your ranch. Mm-hmm. Um Okay. Other let's how about when we how about we play some clippies? clippies. clippies. Huh? Extra, extra. Is that an almond joy? Mm-hmm. All right, guys. Um I've got some episodes from episode I've got some clips from episode two and episode one in here. So let's just let's get into it. We got a we got a few here. This one's called you know. Oh bless. Um this one this one is called Bird Noises. Can you make bird noises? <laughs> good one. That's a that's a question. That was so. That that's such a always, weird question. Yeah, that's that's what, a good interview question. That is a good interview question. Can you make bird noises? Oh, but you have to whisper it. Yeah. Um, Can you make bird noises? <laughs> that's perfect. That should go. That's going in the interview question pile. Nice. Um, this one's called "How the Heck." How the heck did you get here? Okay, that one's <laughs> that one's good. <laughs> that was a good bull. Where the heck? How the heck did you get here? 
<laughs> that's you gotta a, remember that they're in Alabama. That's a True. fucking good in one. Twenty fifty. That yeah, is. <laughs> Let's see. We got this one. By the way, at your desk, that magazine. Yeah, the one on jet skis. <laughs> um, you know, just just <laughs> reaffirming that love. Here's the next clip. Kablooey. Simple. Self-explanatory. Yes. Uh, here's... These two clips are very similar. You're the first person to tell me. What? <laughs> okay, that was the full clip, and let's see this one. All right. Okay. It's doing that thing where it didn't work. Is it? Motherfucker, yeah. dude. How's it gonna do that? Mm -hmm. Do I even have that thing on? Nope. Alright, well that's cool. Yep. It was the... Nah, 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 nah. Oh, yeah. Um, Is it not loud enough? I... I don't know. We'll see. Let's see. I can try putting it up. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That heard do anything? Ah. Definitely heard some of that. Eh, not worth. That's all right. This one. Oh, bless. <laughs> we got so many of those. We got so many. Here's this one. Let's just say, what are you doing? Your salad is Asgard. No, in this scenario. it's not Asgard. It's, That's it's my lunch. Medical. Just hang in. I want and that salad. <laughs> I want it. I want that salad. It's so good. All the expression in this one is so good. Let's just say, what are you doing? Your salad is Asgard. No. In this scenario. It's not Asgard. No. That's it's my lunch. Just hang in there. I want and that salad. No, no it's not. Um, here's another one from that same conversation. And I could also set fire to the palace. No, just stop. Don't set fire okay. to the palace. <laughs> <laughs> Good stuff. Um, here's one from episode one. Good old Mobius Zinger. Trust is for children dogs there's only one person you can trust yourself i like it slap it on a t-shirt slap it on a t-shirt <laughs> so, so like <laughs> condescending so good um here's this one okay i've studied almost every moment of your entire life you've literally stabbed people in the back like 50 times i might never do it again <laughs> good one I think after that, he, what is he? He's like, it's boring now. <laughs> um, let's see. I don't even know what this one's called. Oh, I think I'm fine. I'm well ahead of schedule. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's oh, subtle. I think I'm fine. I'm well ahead of schedule. I'm way ahead of schedule. Scheduled. Oh, I think you'll find I'm way ahead of schedule, sir. <laughs> oh, oh, boss. Oh, boss, I'm way ahead of schedule on this one. What you saying, schedule? Can I have another assignment? I'm way ahead of schedule. <laughs> I think I'm going to need another. I, Hey, boss. Uh, I was going to ask, can I get a ways? You know me. I'm always good with my work. I'm way ahead of schedule. <laughs> it doesn't even make sense. I'm always, hey, I'm always way ahead of schedule. You check my schedule? It's my <laughs> lunch break. Uh oh, <laughs> your way ahead of schedule. <laughs> I don't even know what that means in terms of a lunch break. <laughs> I'm way behind schedule. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> oh, they should have done another take. Um, here's this one. What am I looking at? <laughs> Can you make bird noises? What am I looking at? 
Let's get a good. We need to get a good old representation of Mobius questions. Um, and speaking of good, he's gonna have his own soundboard page. Yeah, Mobius. Yeah, of you know, get get interviewed by Mobius. Hey, how are you doing? Um, uh, first question here. What am I looking at? (laughs) Don't do that to my salad. (laughs) Let's just say, what are you doing? Your salad is Asgard. No, what are you doing? It's not Asgard. That's my lunch. Just hang in there. I want that salad. (laughs) <laughs> speaking of good questions we got this good question what's your name Casey give me the tesseract or I'll gut you like a fish Casey what's a fish <laughs> <laughs> what's a fish you gotta isolate what's a fish yeah that's a good interview question I also yeah. I just like the way that he says his name in the beginning Casey let's see let's just bump that up a little what's bit what's your name Casey. Casey. <laughs> Betty. Betty. Casey. Um, and Wait. last clip. Why'd you have that? Because they're awesome. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Good question, Loki. Um, and everyone, I. That's is that gonna do it for this episode? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Why don't we ask the yes, audience? Sir. Audience, what do you think? You think we should put a can on this one? Woo! Yeah, baby. That's what I've been waiting for. That's what it's all about. Woo! Okay. That's a little. You've been come waiting on. for us to stop. He's been waiting for all us right. to end the show. That's a little rude. We need a new audience. Guys, if you want to be our our next audience, go ahead and and put in put in a give us an email at sh- request shyboyspodcast at gmail Send us that shit and get on, or or you could just tune into twitch.tv slash shyboyspod shyboys underscore podcast mm-hmm. Tuesdays. At about 8 p.m. normally. Yes. Sometime around then. I think that. Thanks, guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, thanks, yeah. guys. See you. Yeah, you take. Love you. Oh. Bye. Oh, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Love you. Bye. Yes, video game.